Hello, everybody, it's me, your good friend Sparky, and welcome back to Spider-Man, the ultimate difficulty New Game Plus playthrough that I am doing so I could get all of the achievements that I don't have, which is two of them. We are switching over to a new costume because it's a new episode. Next up is the Spider Armor Mark II suit. Very fancy and futuristic looking. I like it. I like the yellow, too. Oh, just the facts. At Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't hear, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing masks. Horrible demonic faces. Yet another example of the explosion in mass criminals since Spider Man came on the scene. Let's hear your thoughts. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, I see your point, but Spider Man stopped those guys today. Saying he's like them because he wears a mask isn't fair. It's like prejudice. Wrong. Here's a little lesson in the English language, my friend. Prejudice means to prejudge someone before you know anything about them. I know all I need to about Spider-Man. He runs around causing chaos, wearing a mask so he doesn't have to answer for his shenanigans, and a flashy costume so he gets attention to feed his gigantic, insatiable ego. Now, if I'm a mentally unstable person, and I see him getting all this coverage, what am I going to do? It's called copycat behavior, people, and it's ruining New York. Gotta give JJ credit. He's always got a retort ready, it seems, no matter what you throw at him. Might not be our biggest fan, but, you know, he's at least got a lot to say about us. Anyway, yeah, uh, when we last left off, um, we were late for work. Which is why we're stopping to uh, take pictures of Madison Square Garden and the like. So, uh, we should probably uh, get to where we need to go. After all, we did spend an entire day just kind of, uh, you know, screwing around. And, uh, yeah, doing a side mission that I'm sure really didn't help the fact that we were late for work at all. Uh, where is this crime? Hello? Crime? Crime, are you here? Are you up here? Crime? I saw there was crime nearby. Hi. Are you the crime? I think you're the crime. They are adorable, Peter. They really are. I'm gonna electrocute you. I hate you so much, so I'm just gonna beat you senseless while you can't fight back. And, uh, da, 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 da. impact weapon for you. There we are. Knocking the ever loving stuffing out of dealers is my anti drug. And what an anti drug it is. Sit tight, guys. A nice, comfy paddy wagon will be here soon. Whoop. I didn't mean to go up there. I just want this backpack, please. I don't need it, but I want it. Up the wall, Peter. There we are. Ah, okay. We grabbed a couple backpack things while uh, JJ was talking and such, so let's uh, check those out real quick. Let's see. I think this was one of them. I took a bullet from the cops back when they thought I was working with Electro. Good thing textbooks are thick. Too bad they're also expensive. Yeah, tell me about it. And the worst part is when you can't even sell your textbooks back for some money. Because the teachers in college don't use them anymore. Uh, I have literally a box of textbooks from college. Like, not a small box. A big box of textbooks from college that I used as a doorstop. Because I didn't need them anymore. And there's just no reason to have them. And nobody wanted them. When the vulture cracked my eye lens, it almost blinded me. That was a wake-up call. Had to upgrade to a stronger material. Yeah, I'd say so. Not being able to see seems like a, like a detriment to being Spider-Man. Though it doesn't stop Daredevil. But Daredevil's also like powered by radiation or has super training or something. Depends on the origin. Alright. Anyway. Enough screwing around. 
the doc is waiting for us, and we need to go to work. Right through here. After all, he knows we're busy being Spider-Man's buddy and all, so I think he can forgive us a little bit. Helping him out with all his gadgets and things like that, because he's a nice dude. Ah, and we jog through here. Use our ID card to get in. How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes. <laughs> Hey, what do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Oh, Speak boy. the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. <sighs> Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... But I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work in a secure environment at Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talk about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> oh, Norman Osborne. Always a creep. Easy, easy, easy. They didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. Yeah. And to make it worse, he's the mayor in this continuity. It's great. Real great. It's just fantastic. <laughs> oh well. Bound to happen when he's around. Ah, uh, what next, I I could Peter? Do something to help Doc. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. Wow. Well, Norman never listens to Harry. Even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. You should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. There must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. Well, since we no longer have to go to work, uh, we can instead check out uh, this station Harry Osborne left us. Or left here. Not left us, but. Harry left me a message about these before he left for you. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is, too. Well, I guess he kind of left them to us. gonna pay the bills, but... It sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. 
Yep, yeah, another kind of side quest, quest, side mission type thing. We'll do one of these here, just cuz, but we don't really need to do all of them, I guess. I've got a couple stations measuring air pollution. The idea is to catch the, um, what's the word, contaminants before they reach toxic levels. Now, between you and me, I think Oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting. The amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high and rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. Particles are concentrating in trouble spots, like mini clouds of smog. I'll swing through them and get samples, then trace them to the source. Yeah, things will look a little bit smoggy out here. So we need to try and swing through the clouds and get all the data we need to uh, show that Oscorp's a bunch of jerks that they usually are. Uh, Peter, I was trying to swing. I really was. All right. Nasty as they are, I gotta swing right through those clouds. Yep. Big old corporate fart clouds or something. For these clouds to be visible to the naked eye, the level of toxins must be up there. Funny that they weren't here a few seconds ago, but whatever. And gotcha. Okay. Getting some good stuff. Well, good samples of bad stuff anyway. Hold on. Hold on. I know we're in the middle of something. But uh there's a backpack nearby. I think I need it. It's important. Ow. Is it gonna show up? It's not gonna show me where it is while I'm in the middle of the submission, is it? No, it's not. That's unfortunate. Oh, well. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. There it is. There it is. I was just looking in the wrong place. Where'd it go? Down here. Gotcha. Hi. The jammer I whipped up to jam Vulture's wings. Too bad he improved them after that. Yeah. Kind of unfortunate, that. Anyway, back to swinging through toxic clouds. I'm sure this is in no way hazardous to our health. But, well, I guess that's kind of the point. Because it's definitely going to be hazardous to other people's health if we're not careful. Also, Got it. yeah, kind of hard to tell exactly the height you have to be at and where you have to be to swing through the clouds. And I must be freaking these people out. There we go. What else is new? Huh. The toxins coming from two types of cars and a faulty smokestack. I better get photos. And it's picture time. And aim at the car. Light on that one. There we go. And one more car here. So, a smokestack. Oop, over here. Best smokestack picture I ever took. The Department of Environmental Protection will take it from here. Maybe I should make a green spider costume for Earth Day. Well, that'd be neat. Well, 
Harry Station just stopped a public health crisis. Oscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Indeed. And now there's no more smog or fog. Spider-Man, Shocker has escaped, and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was, but one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. What am I... What am I even taking a picture of here? I don't even know. Nailed it. Officers, please converge on Longacre. Oh, Josie's bar. Because it was on the other side of the building. I didn't see it. Okay, whatever. Ah, uh, yeah, that vehicle chase seems like a problem. Peter, I've been looking into the demons. Sounds like they've quietly established a power base in the vacuum left by Fisk. A vacuum I created by putting Fisk away. Jameson was right. The demons are my fault. What were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. The city, Norman actually, pulled our funding. Oh, Pete, I'm sorry. If Harry were here, he could talk some sense into his dad. You'll find another source. Your work's too important. Thanks, MJ. Talk to you soon. Nice to have her nearby, even though she's not actually our girlfriend. Words of encouragement and all that. But yeah, seems like we've got more things to deal with with shocker oh i just got hit by a helicopter it's fine we're okay i lost our legs but it's 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 fine herman long time no see hey i'm no lawyer but uh i'm pretty sure that's a parole violation <laughs> Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Wanna play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Uh, yeah. Whoa, your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You wanna fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. And now it's time to actually fight Shocker. Ow. You just stupid. Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics? Now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Because if I don't, they'll kill me. So basically, we gotta try and, you know, fling stuff at him to get him to uh, not attack us. And I'm getting a little impatient a lot of the time with this. Just because i that's how I usually play games. I get really impatient. You know, people don't use banks anymore. You're lucky you found actual cash. If you really want to rob banks... Try day trade. It's all the rage. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no! Oh, come on, Herman! If you tell me who you're working for, I can help you cut a deal. If I talk, I'm dead! They made that very clear! Ow. Okay. All right. Oh, wow. We just got knocked the heck out. It's actually the first time that's happened. Well. You tell me who you're working for. I can help you cut a deal. If I talk, I'm dead. They made that very clear. Oh, yeah. 
I think the idea is to try and get off the ground when he does the shockwave, but... Ah. Yeah, ultimate difficulty is showing its ugly face, isn't it? That's a lot of damage. All right, all right. Okay. And now we throw the debris. Trying real hard. Alright, alright, alright. And boom! There we go. Next phase. Give up now and we can protect you! No way! You ain't see what I see! Ow, 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 my face, my everything. Okay, now's the time to pull these loose. And we gotta wait for the right opportunity. Yep. Well, took a couple of hard hits there and lost lost a few times, but you know what? Ultimate difficulty. That's gonna happen once in a while. Man, he was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. Yeah. Demons are a problem. Okay, Yuri. Shocker's all yours now. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, the Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on demon uh, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. Oh, we just knocked down a central feature of the bank, you know. MJ and I applied for this lease, I thought we'd move in together. Instead, we broke up. I can be pretty oblivious sometimes. Yeah. Shocker took a while. Time to catch up on what I've been missing out in the city. And, well, time to do some more city exploration. Oh, wrong button. Let's see. Uh, is there another side mission nearby we can check out? They're here. Might as well do them. Storming the castle. Have fun storming the castle. A uh, little bit of a ways away. There are certain fast travel locations you can jump to if you've been... Oh, uh, no. I guess it's not going to let me. There is fast travel in this game. But... I forget how you're supposed to unlock it. Or be able to go about it. Oh, well. Ah... Uh. Might as well just take the scenic route. Unless somebody calls us at, in the meantime. We've got things we can do. Yeah, let's see. Am I... Didn't I mark this off? Am I even heading in the right direction? 
There we go. That's more like it. Uh, da -da -da -da. Let's go about our swinging business. Doesn't really take that long from get to place to place. And honestly, I prefer doing this way over using the fast travel in general. Just because... Doc left a message. Man. Peter, oh, hello. I might have been a bit hasty advising you to find another job. I have a plan. Give me a bit of time. We may yet live to invent another day. The indomitable Otto Octavius. That's great news. Hope his plan works. Oh, that's good. Glad Otto's finding possibly an alternative source of funding. Hopefully one that's legal. We have a report of a break in, in progress. Yeah, that sounds great. Sounds like a you problem, honestly. I've got things to do. Hey, so I looked into reports of demons. I knew you'd come around. They've been pretty busy tonight, hitting a lot of Fisk properties. They're going after Fisk? Damn. You thinking what I'm thinking? Brewing gang war? Let's try to get ahead of it. Are there any Fisk properties that haven't been hit tonight? Let me see. Patrol reported a bunch of activity at one of his shipyards in Portside. Thanks, Yuri. I'll check it out. Well, I mean, we're already here, so we might as well just do this. Ah, let's see. Hey, hey Yuri. Any idea what Fisk uses that shipyard for? No idea. Let me send an officer to meet you there. His name's Jefferson Davis. That's his beat. He's a good cop. Been working the Fisk case for years. If anyone knows what's going on at that shipyard, it's him. Okay. Like I said, we'll do that later. We have do more nighttime bird watching? Well, I was watching for nocturnal things to do. raptors in the park when I noticed a bunch of men armed with rifles over at Belvedere Castle. Thanks for the heads up, Miss uh Stephanie. Let me know if I can help. I'll keep an eye on the activities from up here. Thanks for the assist, Stephanie. Why would armed men be at Belvedere Castle? Got a hunch they're not tourists. Yeah, you never know. Maybe those guns they have are just fancy cameras. I don't know. It's possible. Not everyone armed with a gun is out to shoot somebody. I guess. Fisk's man. This isn't good. Hi. Yeah. Gotta be careful of the sniper guys, too. They are definitely an issue. Hi. Nice of you to join me. You, too. Oh, you are not. Ow, my everything. Hi. Hello. That's all of them. We did it. Let's find out what they were up to. Sounds like a plan. Da, 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 da. Not right. sure what's going on here. I wonder if there's any info I can get from this flash drive. Awesome. Stephanie, a bird just stole a flash drive full of evidence. Maybe a pigeon. Is that normal? It is nesting season, so I'm not surprised. You know, I think there's a nest in the trees just southeast of the castle. Great. I'll check it out. And it's time for some pigeon hunting. You got buddies. Great. Come back with that flash drive, you dirty sky rats! Try positive reinforcement. You know, pigeons are actually remarkably intelligent. Remarkably intelligent, huh? Uh, hey pigeons! Sorry about the dirty sky rats thing. Maybe we can make a deal? Whatever Fisk is paying you in birdseed, I'll double it! Yeah. Got one. He doesn't have the drive. We gotta chase pigeons around. And catch them before they fly away. This is a thing that we're doing in a Spider-Man game. Well, we could be doing the pizza delivery. Fuck yes. But, uh, yeah. This sort of little side diversion is really nice once in a while. And gotcha. This is it. I've got the drive. Back Neat. The laptop to see what Fisk's men were up to. And it's back this way. There's actually an. In is it this game or is it the next game where there's like an entire p 
pigeon hunting expedition you go on. It might be this game. I don't remember Looks though. Like they were uploading a worm to the Central Park Wi-Fi system. This could give them backdoor access to a ton of personal data. Come to think of it, even I use this network. Wait, it's still uploading remotely. There must be multiple access points. Stephanie, you're my eyes in the sky. See anything else strange in the park? I see a pair of horned owls and... Oh, more guys at a nearby junction box. Thanks. Keep a lookout for anything else. I need to get to that junction box before the upload completes. If they can't access the laptop, they can't upload. Good idea. Do you now? I see you too. You're ugly. So the whole point of this part is that we need to stop these guys before they can fully access that laptop. And knocking them as far away from it as possible is usually a good idea. Thanks for the heads up. I better get moving. Two more? I never thought I'd say this. But why does Central Park need such strong Wi-Fi coverage? I thought people came here to get away. There they are. I need to keep them away from that box. Ow, that's three bullets to my face. Yeah. Yeah, okay. You should have seen a bed. We need to take care of these guys so we can go get the other one. Hi. Please stop doing that. Only one more to go. And off we go to the next one. Pigeons in the park were in on this. I know it. And... Hello. Oh, we didn't see that coming. It's me, your friendly neighborhood. I'm this uh, spider person. Oh, a grenade. That's no good. You guys probably shouldn't play with those. I hear they're very dangerous. Hi. What did I just tell you about playing with grenades? It is very, very bad of you. Shoot you with the spider drone. People of Manhattan can rest easy knowing that their passwords and cat videos are safe. Spider-Man? I think they might have seen me. Oh no. Are you sure? Uh, pretty sure. Armed men just arrived. Lock the roof entrance and hold tight. I'm on my way. Oh, Stephanie. I need to get to Stephanie before Fisk's men do. She wouldn't be involved if it weren't for me. I mean, she's the one that tipped us off to begin with, They're so... Right down the door. We know you're working with the spider. Open up! Nearly there. How would they really know? Or even notice? Ow, oh, sorry, 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 excuse sorry. me, sorry. I am split up and find the girl with the binoculars. Ah, uh, hi. Oh there you are. Okay. Hi. No, I don't think so. Guys, I just told you not to play with those. It's very dangerous. And you! I don't like your haircut. Oh, you're done. Okay. Gotta... Thank you, and you've got a gun, and that's dumb of you. That's all of them. Get out of here. Check on Stephanie. Stephanie, are you dead? Are you alright? Do you live to bird watch another day? Oh, thank you, Spider-Man. That was a little more exciting than my average night of birding. Hey, thank you. Your eagle eyes stopped an incarcerated crime boss from harvesting half the city's personal data. Not too shabby, huh? Plus, I found a nest of red-breasted nuthatches when you triple kicked that guy in the face. Real beauties, too. You want to check them out? Thanks, but uh, I think I'll focus on jailbirds for now. Oh, Spider-Man. You and your quips. 
But, uh, yeah, I guess that's going to call it for right now. We saved Central Park, and we did some bird watching too, which is always a fun activity. But, uh, we'll check things out and see what the demons are up to next time. Thank you very much for watching. This is your good friend Sparky signing off for now, and I will catch you later. As much as I do love birds, it's wise words to never trust a pigeon. You never know when they're going to harvest your personal data. <laughs>